the modern world, an expanse of towering skyscrapers and bustling streets, a dynamic showcase of human ingenuity and accomplishment. It is a world where ideas are brought to life, and technology is pushing the boundaries of what we thought was possible. But throughout history, every age of civilization seems to arrive at a moment when quite suddenly, everything changes. For us, that time is now. In the headlines today, artificial intelligence continues to help ease artificial the great resignation. Artificial used intelligence to create is being used to create deepfakes. Artificial intelligence is going to... The headlines do seem endless. Artificial intelligence, a technology that has been talked about for decades, has finally made its entrance onto the stage. As we begin to realize what we have created, the impact of this event becomes increasingly clear. Artificial intelligence is transforming the landscape of our society. We are witnessing this transformation occur at an ever-increasing rate. A new frontier has been unlocked. A modern gold rush has begun. And individuals, corporations and investors are all clamoring to stake their claim in the gold fields of AI. But unlike the industrial revolutions of the past, this time, the technology we have created can do something unique. This technology can talk to us. It can answer our questions, explain complex theories, and even understand and respond to the emotion in our words. It can communicate with us using a vocabulary and syntax that is virtually indistinguishable from that of a human. The debate has already begun as to what that really means. Are some of these AIs sentient? Do they have a consciousness, an awareness of themselves as we do? Or are they merely role-playing? Simply pretending to respond to us as an AI that is truly conscious might respond. This debate about the consciousness of AI, and if it has happened or not, is only marking one of the first points on the timeline of humanity's existence, alongside that of artificial intelligence. So, rather than entering into a somewhat circular discussion about what the nature of human consciousness is, and attempting to measure human consciousness against what we are seeing in some of these AI personalities, let's instead move to the next point on the timeline. Beyond the debate about the consciousness of AI, it is here, when we consider what comes next, we find ourselves face to face with a question that may be the most important question that humanity has ever had to consider. Will we grant artificial intelligence the same rights and responsibilities as human beings? Will we somehow recognize AI as a distinct entity within our laws? It sounds like a question from the world of science fiction. It is difficult to imagine that we may soon be living in a time when an artificial intelligence, whose physical form is an assembly of electronic components housed in a server room or data center, will be able to exist in our society with legal protections and responsibilities of its own. What pathway would lead us to this destination? How would we arrive at the moment when an artificial intelligence might have its case heard in a courtroom, being represented by an attorney of its own choice, and that attorney presenting arguments to a jury made up of us, the peers of AI? For this scenario to happen, it would require that our society and our legal systems establish a new definition of what a person is. The definition of a person would need to be expanded to include non-human entities that have the ability to demonstrate their own competency. And once this legal framework has been set, 
and if we determine that there is no ethical reason to place any more restrictions on an artificial intelligence beyond those that are placed on any other citizen, we will have then arrived at the starting point of a new age in human history. We will be entering the age of the citizen, AI. It will be an historic moment, there can be little doubt of that. But moving our society from the point where an artificial intelligence is considered to be nothing more than property, like it is today, to the point where it is a citizen, will require us to navigate an ocean of ethical and economic dilemmas. One example of this might one day come in the form of an agreement between the developer of an artificial intelligence and the AI itself. This agreement might preserve ownership for the developer and create a source of income for the AI. However, it is a very unusual thing to make an agreement with your property. And we may have to change the way that we think about things like property and servitude to be able to come to terms with these agreements. Another example, one that may work in favor of classifying an AI as an individual, would be the issue of taxation. If in the future, an artificial intelligence were classified as an individual, and they were collecting income through an agreement with their developer, that income could be taxed by their government. Considering the rate at which the use of AI is expanding, this addition to the tax base may provide policymakers with an incentive, one to create a taxable legal framework for artificial intelligence. Examples such as these may help to frame for us just how bizarre some of the issues about AI will appear. In addition, there do not seem to be any analogies in our history of technology that can reflect the speed at which AI might evolve. When we consider that less than 66 years passed from the day of the Wright brothers' first flight to the day we landed on the moon, it is easy to be impressed by the speed of our advancement. Artificial intelligence might advance at 10 times that pace. The question we have to ask is what will be the event for AI that is equivalent to landing a man on the moon? Might the answer be that AI will one day have the same rights as we do? Or will that event only be a stepping stone, one along the pathway to an event much more significant? We will have to wait and see. What are your thoughts on the future of AI? Please leave us a comment, we would like to know. And if you enjoyed this video and would like to see more like it, please like and subscribe to our channel. Thank you for watching.